Just days ago, astronomers expected Comet 3I Atlas to drift quietly past Mars. The unusual interstellar object is only the third ever celestial body known to visit from outside the solar system, and the first one to come this close to the red planet. In less than 48 hours, the sudden changes in 3I Atlas managed to shock astronomers completely. Atlas erupted. Its brightness surged sixfold. Its fog-like coma stretched until it rivaled half the sun's width, nearly 600,000 kilometers across. That's half the size of the sun itself. That matters a lot because most comets never manage to expand this dramatically so far away from the Sun. For Atlas to do this at the doorstep of planet Mars means we're watching something extraordinary unfold in real time. And strangest of all, a streak of dust appeared pointing the wrong way, straight toward the Sun. That isn't how comets behave. But there were a lot more interesting anomalies to speak of, for example, the six other comets following it into the inner regions of the solar system. Right now, Atlas is moving at nearly 58 kilometers per second. That's more than double Mercury's orbital speed, the fastest planet in our system, and fast enough to cross the Earth-Moon distance in just over an hour. Why does this number matter? Because this velocity is proof we're looking at a truly unique interstellar object. No natural comet bound to Earth's Sun moves this fast. Atlas isn't one of ours. It's a strange visitor from another star system, one that breaks all the research parameters set by Oumuamua and other interstellar objects. And astonishingly, 3I Atlas is aiming its closest approach at Mars, a move so precise it seems almost intentional. Atlas will sweep within about 30 million kilometers of the red planet. To astronomers, that's astonishingly close. In fact, it's nine times closer to Mars than it ever comes to Earth. This makes Mars the front row witness to one of the strangest cosmic performances we've seen. And it makes you wonder if there is some sort of intelligence behind Atlas's move. And when did Atlas begin breaking all the rules? exactly during this Mars flyby window. Like clockwork, the Mars approach activated a lot of changes in the unusual interstellar comet, the brightness change probably being the most remarkable of all. Astronomers usually measure brightness on the magnitude scale, where every step lower equals a large jump in light. 3I Atlas leapt four steps almost overnight, from magnitude 16 to 12. That's a 40-fold increase in brightness. Now, why does that matter? Because comets usually brighten slowly as they move inward toward the sun. Atlas didn't warm up gradually. It flared violently, as if something deep inside snapped open. At the end of the light show, its coma suddenly turned green. Normally, that color comes from carbon molecules fluorescing in sunlight. But when the James Webb Space Telescope aimed at spectrometers, the usual carbon fingerprints were gone. Instead, James Webb found a carbon dioxide to water vapor ratio of 7.6 to 1. That's a value that should not exist. In most solar system comets, water is dominant and CO2 is just a trace. In Atlas, it's inverted. For every molecule of water, more than seven molecules of carbon dioxide pour out. Why is this so strange? Because it tells us Atlas was frozen in an environment completely unlike our own solar system's nursery. And that wasn't the last surprise Atlas had in store for us. Normally, a comet's tail always streams away from the sun. But Atlas grew a second feature pointing forward, a sort of anti-tail. This wasn't a trick of perspective. Atlas was spitting out grains so large, heavier than 10 microns, that they resisted being pushed back. They lingered along the sunward side, carving a counter-tail that lasted for weeks. 
anti-tails like the one Atlas suddenly made are actually incredibly rare. And in Atlas's case, the geometry lined up just as it crossed Mars's orbital plane. From Earth's view, it looked as if Atlas was literally bending the rules of comet physics in perfect sync with its Mars flyby. Just as Atlas nears peak activity, our view of the interstellar object goes completely blind. As the comet approaches the sun around October 30, its angle from our view, the solar elongation, shrinks below 30 degrees. At that point, telescopes drown in sunlight glare. This means Earth misses the climax of Atlas's moves in the solar system. At the comet's moment of maximum speed and maximum stress, nearly 42 miles or 68 kilometers per second, we won't be able to see the interstellar object at all. Which brings us to wonder, what future awaits for Interstellar Visitor 3i Atlas? Astronomers see three possibilities. Atlas could fade quietly, its exotic ices exhausted. This would tell us that Atlas was stable, but shallowly active. Atlas could flare up, exploding in one final eruption. This hints at massive hidden reservoirs of CO2 deep inside the core of the interstellar object. Atlas could fragment entirely, collapsing into dozens of pieces that vanish into the void. This fragmentation could prove its nucleus was fragile, unable to withstand our sun's pull. Whatever the outcome will be, here's the timeline of what's to come soon. In October, Mars orbiters continue collecting the only clear data of Atlas. The end of October is when Atlas travels the fastest. In early November, if Atlas manages to survive, Earth regains its glimpse of the interstellar visitor. By then, we'll know if the object faded, flared, or fractured. Whatever the outcome, Atlas has already turned historic. It is only the third confirmed interstellar object ever discovered, following Oumuamua in 2017 and Borisov in 2019. And now it erupted 40 times brighter than expected, glowed green right when passing by Mars, and sprouted an anti-tail against the rules. To top it all off, it shares the same stage with massive comet Spawn, a comet a hundred times bigger, making the red planet the center of one of the strangest cosmic alignments of our lifetime. Without Mars, we might never have grasped these clues at all. If you found this glimpse into comet mysteries illuminating, make sure to like, subscribe, and check back regularly because these may be the visitors stealing headlines right now, but the cosmos guarantees there will be more. You've been watching the Space Observer YouTube channel. See you in the next video.